Welcome to Charlie's Cards, where baseball's greats are recognized. We bust open boxes and rip packs to find baseball's superstars, so let's play ball! Hello everybody, Charlie's Cards, welcome this evening to the table. What do I bring? I bring a uh, hundred cards of Topps Gallery 2020. I went to my local, usually barren, big box store and found this uh, kind of tucked back like somebody was saving it. And uh, I snatched it up. I was actually looking for supplies. And I found that laying there and I thought, what the heck? Oh, there is first a box topper. This is the big one. This has got two autographs and a box topper. And uh, look for original paintings and rookie autograph cards. 20 packs, five cards per pack. Packs with a special insert, blah, blah, blah. And there's the different designs and there is the odds cut signature that's the one we'll go for huh <laughs> all right so we got one gallery box loader and a whole bunch of packs so Let's break it up. Let's break it open. Let's rip, grip it, and rip it, and then flip it over and see what we get. Not the hugest fan of gallery, but it is it is interesting. So let's go through this and see what we can find. There's a Corey Kluber. There's a Bauer. There's a Christian Walker. Modern. Modern artist. Modern artists. All right. Derek Cole. Grip it. Rip it. Flip it. There's a Hilliard. There's a Dubon rookie card. There's a Manny Machado. Uh, sparkly one. I thought, man, the bottom's all jacked up, but it, it's on the chrome. It looks like it's wet, so not numbered, but that's cool, Manny. There's a Noah. And uh, Jordan Montgomery. So we'll set some of those aside. Hope everybody's well. I know that it is becoming increasingly more difficult now that it's off season for everybody to participate in purchasing baseball cards. I hate to see people in their usual mode of driving all over town looking for baseball cards when it probably won't happen now. So, Matt Chapman, ultimately your best bet, gallery private issue, Abram Toro rookie card. So let's put that down there. Go to your LCS, only place that's got cards. I think uh, the one uh, one of the hardest artist perspectives in the entire planet is making a person look like that person when you uh, when you draw them. Okay, so that's the cutch. There's a uh, Jorge Solar. There's a Bragg.
of taking his fourth straight trip to the showcase. Art by Kevin Grissom. Gallery Heritage. Looked like an on-card auto. Really did. So, that's a... And the Jalen Davis rookie card. That looked like an on-card auto. Kind of thought, man, I don't, I've never gotten a Francisco Lindor autograph. That'd be cool. All right, let's see what else we can find. There's another one of those sparkly ones. Trevor Richards. So we'll put that over there. Master and Apprentice. Frank Thomas and Luis Robert. Robert. So, that's cool. And an Aaron Chevalier. I miss baseball. So, we can make it up in the card community by uh, pulling out some cards and doing some videos. So, find little topics as I will. I'm uh, approaching my 150th video. I've already got 150 subscribers. So I'm, I'm really racking my brain uh, trying to find Sandy Koufax Hall of Fame card. Trying to find something to do with it. I uh, put that down there. Sandy Koufax was amazing. Haven't... Uh, come up with an idea for the video, nor have I found something to do with a giveaway. So, since that's the expectation, I don't know if it's the expectation. I would like to know. So, tell me what you feel about uh, does it do, do giveaways and uh, VRs, video responses? Do they are they meaningful to you? Do they make a difference? Uh, are they something you look for? Because uh, everybody wants to win free stuff. So, there's a... Now, see, that looks like Juan Soto. That really looks like Juan Soto. That looks like Juan Soto more than his rookie looks like Juan Soto. <laughs> I'll show you that in the reveal when I get my uh, cards back. See, that Acuna, that looks like Acuna. So, that's that's, that's a good one. Nelson Cruz and Joey Bato. He's a Bato. And as most of you know, and if you don't, uh, Charlie's Cards has started an eBay channel. Uh, I'm sorry, an eBay store. So I uploaded a whole bunch more cards on there. And as I open cards, uh, I will be putting those on my eBay channel. And as a viewer and subscriber, you always have uh, you always have more of an opportunity to purchase a, a card uh, for a, an admirable price. So, if there's something on there that you see you like, and this is our first autograph, if you see something on there you like, go ahead and uh, shoot me a message. And I will be happy to work a fabulous deal with any of my subscribers and anyone that's part of the card community away from, uh, from uh, the typical eBay customer. So as a Charlie's Cards subscriber, you have an opportunity to uh, make some bids. So this is Hunter Harvey. Sticker Auto, numbered to 99. Uh-huh. So, Orioles. 
Never heard of him. <laughs> Hunter Harvey, though. All right, so that's our first auto. Hunter Harvey. Was hoping for a uh, Luis Roberts. Yeah, right. There's Chris Bryant. The Rue. There's another one, Clayton Kershaw. I, I've been looking at his. Uh, there's a Nico Horner rookie card. That's cool. Uh, been looking at his autograph lately. I didn't know. It's pretty cool. So we'll put that down there with the special ones over there. Anthony K rookie card. There's a uh, Oscar Hernandez, Master and Apprentice. So that's Big Poppy, and uh, Yamaguchi. That's Big Poppy and Rafael Devers. All right, let's rip some more and rip some more. What do you say? Might as well open them all, huh? I don't know how much of this one box was. Have to see. There's the artists. Uh, Jeff McNeil. I was gonna say if that's the polar bear, no way. All right. There's an AJ Puck. I did participate in a break uh, last night. With uh, priceless breaks, uh, went on there after someone had beat me out of a bid for the Oakland A's. Went on there and the guy didn't pay. So there's a Kyle Lewis. Oh yeah, gallery private issue. Kyle Lewis. Can it be numbered? Yes, two fifty. Congratulations, Charlie's cards. Well, thank you. Thank you very much. Let's uh, sleeve that up. So again, I participated in a break with uh, with Priceless Breaks, and I got the A's, and I got a redemption of uh, AJ Puck, a redemption for Panini, which I'm I'm fearful of. Modern artist, that's Aquino, Aristides Aquino. And then I got a news, N-E-U-S-E, -E, news auto too. So when I get those in, I'll be showing those off. Yeah, it's just Strimsky, uh, Mikey. That's that's not bad. That that does look like him. The Bryce Harper. And if you. Speaking of the eBay store, if you PC anybody and you're looking for a particular color or rainbow or whatever, uh, a particular collector or, or player, um, shoot it in the comments and uh, I'll see what I got. I am looking to make some profit off my cards. STD's Aquino rookie card. Zach Lettle. That's, see, that looks like Mike Clevenger with the hair. That's kind of cool. Shin So Chu. Logan Webb with the Giants. And uh, Mike King, never heard of him.
All right, still got quite a few packs still coming. All righty. There's one of the guys we're looking for. Luis Robert. So he has a new a new manager. 76-year-old Tony LaRussa after being out of the league for quite a few years, came out of retirement and and is, has become the manager of uh, Luis Robert. And the uh, and the White Sox. So that's uh, that's interesting. So that's a good one, Luis Robert. Glaber Day, yeah, almost. All right, Marcelo Zuna. Yeah, kind of looks like an on-card auto, but it's not. So I'll go down here with the yellow ones. And this man, Eloy Jimenez, will be. A manager for Eloy Jimenez. And I saw him on uh, Hot Stove today. Hot Stove is on Major League Baseball MLB Network. They're talking a lot about, you know, trades and, and what they're going to do and who they're going to hire. And then the Astros manager was signed with the uh, Detroit Tigers. So they got a new manager. Okay, so there's Bagwell and <coughs> excuse me. Yordan. Bagwell, uh, they're both, I didn't know that. They were both uh, NL Rookies of the Year. So that's cool. Yeah, that looks like Eric Thames. But I guess it kind of depends on the artist, you know. Like I say, it's it's a challenge to, to draw or paint or whatever to artistically provide somebody with a picture that looks like them. Yeah, Altuve, not not the eyes, no, the, the chin, yeah, but Mitch Moreland, Pablo Lopez, Mr. Jeter, yeah, kind of, yeah, and there's Harvey Hunter, again, So we'll probably be coming up on our autograph here pretty soon. There's my boy Sean Murphy. That's cool. Wish it would have been one of the uh, special ones. See? No. If you were not to look at the name, who would you say that is? I uh, I don't see it, but it's supposed to be Chipper Jones, Hall of Fame Chipper Jones. Chipper had a goatee. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Interesting. All right, and Brendan McKay. Your PC Brendan McKay, I got his card here. Hit me up. That's big red for sure. I also uh, curious how many of you guys that uh, are part of my uh, family and friends 
uh, also has a Facebook or an Instagram or a Twitter account uh, associated with their YouTube page or their card collecting and selling. So if you could please just shoot me a little saying, yeah, you know, I, yeah, I do that on so-and-so, I'd appreciate it because uh, thinking about going the next step, you know, it, it was a uh, long, hard road, but you got to kind of, there's two. Uh, Saint, there's two uh, Cardinals that won World Series together, I think. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, Molina and Robert Pujol. See, kind of, sort of, but. but I do appreciate everybody's insight, everybody's help. Tell me how it's going on your. Uh, there's a Lazardo. Yeah, I don't know. The one thing about baseball, you definitely see the player a lot more than you do, let's say, in football. Football, sometimes you don't even know what the guy looks like. So, should be coming across to my autograph here pretty soon. There's a Justin Upton, Colin Moran. Marwin Gonzalez. Yushi Kakuchi. See that? No. Alright, let's get back to Marwin. This is just a base auto. Marwin Gonzalez. It's not a rookie. Not a rookie card. Interesting signature it uh it is a sticker marwin gonzalez acquired free agent born 1989 free agent 2000 so this is what his second year marwin gonzalez so Okay. All right. Well, there's a good one on the bottom. The world champion. Los Angeles Dodgers. Zach Gallen, rookie card. Junior Fernandez. Rafael Devers. Okay, so Chris Bryant probably on the right and I'm not a big Cubs fan so there's a Gavin Lux that's nice Gavin Lux that, that looks like him nice Gavin Lux rookie card so who is that Ron Santo okay Ron Santo all right. As we got everything together, um, just a little brief rundown, and then we'll uh, then we'll open the uh, box loader. So I got a Sean Murphy. I like that Sean Murphy rookie card. There's Big Red, Dustin May, world champion. Happy for him, Jose Lazardo. I don't know if he'll be a part of the championship squad. There's an Abraham Toro. Uh, it's called the Gallery Private Issue. And it's numbered to 250. Couple autos. Uh, the uh, Master and Apprentice, Luis Roberts. The Master and Apprentice, Jordan Alvarez. I think the best one of these is, uh, they are beautiful cards. Manny Machado. And then uh, Luis Robert. Standard. But I think this is, this is, 
the uh, box hit for this particular box. Uh, Kyle Lewis. And it's a gallery private issue. And it's numbered to 250. 29 of 250. So I like my Kyle Lewis. All right. So let's see what we got here. Look for original paintings. Original paintings. No purchase necessary. Jackie Robinson, Rachel Robinson, Horace Wagner, Babe Ruth. There's all these different families of these superstars that are... God, Ted Williams, Jackie Robinson. I mean, they are all living off their... Probably their grandpa or their great-grandpa's... Uh, baseball career yeah. well that's cool nothing wrong with the kid now can it be an original wow look at that I don't think it's an original how would you know that it'd probably be numbered I imagine the kid Well, that's cool. That can go up on the shelf with the uh, Riley Griffey, my 2020, Project 2020 Griffey. And one of my favorite 2020s, other than the Man of Steel. All right, so that's the extent of it, everybody. I am had fun opening that box and I hope you did too uh, if you enjoyed that there's more to come at Charlie's cards so go ahead and hit that subscription button poke your finger on that bell so you know when Charlie's cards makes another video you'll be informed give me a comment I asked you a couple questions during the video I appreciate your support and conversations Give me a like if you if you like that. And this is Charlie's Cards opening a box of 2020 gallery. Not doing the best, but it was fun. And that's what it's all about. It's about the community. And we call it the card community. Long video. Thanks much everybody. Have a great rest of the week or whenever you're watching this. God bless. Charlie's Cards. Wait. Over and out.